It's been my delight uh, since my appointment as Director of the Institute of Dentistry in Aberdeen to see just what a special place this is. So I've been involved in dental education my whole career and I've worked in a number of institutions um, across the country. The uniqueness of the University of Aberdeen's Institute of Dentistry is that we're a small school. Uh, small numbers of students with a fantastic staff-student ratio. So our students here are well catered for. Uh, they have a great um, educational experience. It's a really small school and um, you get a one-on-one -on -one kind of teaching which is really helpful in the first uh, steps you take as a student dentist. It's a nice wee family here. Everyone's been very welcoming and friendly and I've been able to take advantage of the fantastic facilities that sort of drew me to Aberdeen. We use advanced digital technology in, our, uh, in training our students in clinical skills. They, to an extent, take control of their own learning, empowering their learning process. In my class I have people from physiology backgrounds, anatomy, medicine, even dental technicians and that really brings it together nicely, it's really unique. Uh, our students are held in very high esteem, uh, not only during the training here but when they graduate um, and it's very clear that our vocational training colleagues within wider Scotland are very keen to have Aberdeen University graduates um, to continue their uh, development as, as fledgling dentists within the wider healthcare system. And that really meets one of the purposes of developing a dental school to me. Undergraduate students, yes, but also create a suite of postgraduate courses that help the local and wider dental and professional community. We want to build a world-leading centre for research and knowledge exchange in oral health here at the University of Aberdeen. And for this purpose, we have a group of academics with very respected research profiles who work on themes that focus on key challenges facing oral health worldwide. We have very clear research themes um, emerging as part of our involvement with the wider Scottish Oral Health Research Collaboration. Uh, but there are a number of uh, new initiatives taking place, particularly around head and neck cancer, uh, wider aspects of public health dentistry, uh, but importantly also we are developing uh, an, a, a portfolio of leadership within um, dental education research um, and that's an area that I uh, expect to uh, increase significantly over the next five to ten years.